Hello comic book guys and gals, and welcome to Comic Mag Musings. This guy's your host, Bill Miller. All right. We have an unboxing in store. Probably pretty quick. I think I know what this is. And with our right-handed box cutter, we shall soon find out. Packaging material from Goodwill. All right. And a bag inside a box. Let's try to do this carefully. No bags and boards. What are you going to do? All right. I guess technically there's a bag <laughs> that they were in. All right, so... This isn't why I got it, but I guess it was part of it. The NOM issue number 27. We have Simper Phi, issue number five. And of course, Looney Tunes, or Looney Tunes Dog Show. And Bugs is showing off a hot dog. Which one is this? Uh, from 1977. All right, but this is why I got it. I had never seen these before. So pretty cool, I think. Spider-Man Comics Magazine. And it's quite a stretch to call them magazines, but super cool. They are tiny. This one is what? Number six. This one is number six. There's the back. What's it say inside? Spider-Man Comics Magazine, Volume 1. Number six from 1987, and it looks like regular issues, regular stories reduced way down to this size. All right. Full color. So pretty cool. Volume one, issue number six. Um, what do we got here? Let's see if we can get these in order. All right, here's issue number seven. Featuring Man Mountain Marco, the web Closes. On the back. And now, Quicksilver. All right. We have eight anywhere. Oh, we have two of number six. All right. So two of number six, we had seven. Here is eight. The lizard lives on 
the back. Death without warning. So they're all in pretty good shape. They look like they, some of them may never have been opened. No reader's creases or bangs. And this is hard, hard, sturdy, hard stock cardboard. So, um, we have number five. The Madness of Mysterio. On the back, Escape Impossible. So that's number five. Number four. Spidey versus the Vulture. On the back, we have Medusa. Oh, and there's the spine. $1.50. Spider-Man Comics Magazine. And then... Right there. July... Number four. Number three. And on the back, he's playing merry-go-round with Kingpin. Try to keep them in some semblance of order. Number two. And Doc Ock on the back. Marvel Comics Group presents. Here's number one. And on the back, in the clutches of Kingpin. All right, so we've got one through, what, eight? What else do we have? Well, no nine, but we do have number 10. Three big spidey tales in this issue, featuring Electro Chameleon the kangaroo. And he says to all of you, G'day, mate. The coming of the kangaroo on the back. So that's number 10. And then we have number 11. The Kingpin strikes back, and on the back, Kingpin say, it says, nothing can save you now. So that's issue number 11. Let's put these in order, Two, three, four, five. Two sixes. Seven, eight, 
only missing that rascally nine so far. Here is number 12. Goblin, the Goblin Lives. And on the back, it says Special Collector's Item Issue. Spider-Man Magazine number 12. And we have number 13. This is our last one. So, don't know how many there are in Volume 1. I'll have to find out, but I know that we're missing number 9. And on the back, beware the Black Widow. Issue number 13, and that will do it for our super cool Spider-Man Comics Magazine unboxing. I hope you enjoyed seeing them, and if you did, I would encourage you to subscribe and hit that notification bell. That way you're alerted as soon as I release new videos. Thumbs up and comments are always appreciated, and remember... We're taking over the world. One comic book magazine at a time.